You going? Okay. Uh, what we have here is the spare air that is going to be left in the common dock for purposes of diving down to the bottom of the lake when you need to repair an anchor, uh, buoy line, or uh, for whatever reason, if you need to go down and, and need some air, then you can use this. It's good for about 50 to 60 breaths, which in my experience is uh, good for about two to three uh, anchor repairs, depending on how much time you spend down there. When you run out of air, and Davis, can you come and get a close up on this pressure gauge and get a reading there? So right now the needle's at about 1,000 PSI, and you don't wanna go all the way down to zero because it can damage the tank if it doesn't have any uh, pressure in there. So you wanna stop at about 200 or 300 uh, or so PSI and then refill. So when it needs to be refilled, this is what I wanna show you. You just take this cap off right here. This tank will be in the dock as well, and you just hook it on here. Screw this on until it stops turning. And then the key here is just want to let the air go in really slow because otherwise it'll heat up and you won't get as much air in there. So you can fill it, uh, tighten up, and that means the air is going in. You can watch the needle start to rise. Can you get a close up on the needle there and see it going up? Okay, so back up, Davis. So now when you hear the air coming out, I turned it off, and you got to release this, and then retighten it, and do it again. So if the seal is broken and it starts leaking air out of here, then you just got to go through that exercise. So still rising here. And it's going to go up to about 3,000 PSI. It'll only go up as high as whatever the pressure is in this big tank. So over time, as this tank loses pressure, uh, say to 2,000 or 1,500, then the spare air will only be filled up to 2,000 or 1,500. And if that, once it gets down to around 1,000, we'll go fill this tank up again. So now that it's stopped, the needle stopped moving, uh, we're going to go ahead and turn this off. And then you just twist. Twist this back off of here, and place the cap back on, and this will be kept in this little bag in the box. Okay, shut it off.